The internet, it's vast, it's mysterious, and it holds secrets. Deep within its hidden corners lies the dark web. Many are drawn to its allure, tempted by anonymity and forbidden knowledge, but it's a dangerous world riddled with risks. Think of the internet like an iceberg. The tip is the surface web. It's where we shop, socialize, and catch up on news. But beneath lies the dark web. This is where things get murky. The dark web is deliberately hidden. You need special software to access it. The appeal of the dark web is undeniable, but it's not for the faint of heart, and it's a place you should avoid at all costs. To understand the dark web, you need to understand what makes it different. When you browse the regular internet, you're on the surface web. It's like walking down a well-lit street. You can see where you're going. You can see who's around. It feels relatively safe. The dark web is different. It's like entering a dark alley. You can't use regular search engines like Google to find things there. You need special software like Tor that helps you remain anonymous. This anonymity is a double-edged sword. It protects users but also shields illegal activities. Imagine trying to find a specific store in a city but the city has no map and all the street signs are in a language you don't understand. That's what navigating the dark web can feel like. It's confusing and it's easy to get lost. But unlike getting lost in a city, getting lost on the dark web can have serious consequences. The dark web is notorious for its black markets. These digital bazaars offer everything from drugs and weapons to stolen data. It's a reminder that not everything online is legal or ethical. Imagine a marketplace filled with stolen credit card numbers and dangerous weapons. This is the reality of the dark web's black markets. It's important to understand what goes on in these hidden corners. The anonymity makes it perfect for criminals to peddle their wares. Buyers also face serious legal repercussions. Law enforcement agencies are working to shut down these marketplaces. They offer a glimpse into a world where anything is for sale. The dangers of the dark web are not hypothetical. Real people just like you and me have faced serious consequences for venturing into its depths. Take for example the case of Ross Ulbricht, the creator of the Silk Road. This online black market operated on the dark web, facilitating the sale of billions of dollars worth of illegal drugs. Ulbricht, a young man who believed he was creating a platform for freedom, was eventually caught and sentenced to life in prison. His story is a cautionary tale about the real-world consequences of dabbling in the illegal activities that flourish on the dark web. Then there's the case of a group of teenagers who thought they could make some quick cash by buying stolen credit card information on the dark web. They ended up facing felony charges, jeopardizing their futures before they even had a chance to begin. These stories are a stark reminder that the dark web is not a game. It's a dangerous playground where the stakes are high and the consequences are real. Section 5. The Price of Curiosity. You might be thinking, I'm just curious, I'm not going to buy anything illegal. But curiosity can be a dangerous thing on the dark web. Even simply browsing can expose you to serious risks. The dark web is a breeding ground for malware, viruses, and other online threats. Imagine clicking on a link that promises exclusive information or free downloads. Instead of finding what you were looking for, you inadvertently download a virus that steals your personal information or hijacks your computer. This is a very real possibility on the dark web. Cyber criminals lurk in the shadows, waiting to prey on unsuspecting users who stray from the well-lit paths of the surface web. They set traps disguised as harmless links or tempting offers, ready to pounce on anyone who lets their curiosity get the better of them. The dark web is not a place for casual browsing. It's a place where one wrong click can have devastating consequences. Section 6. Malware's Playground One of the biggest dangers of the dark web is the prevalence of malware. This malicious software can wreak havoc on your computer and your life. It can steal your passwords. It can spy on your every keystroke. It can even lock you out of your own files and hold them hostage for ransom. Imagine opening an email that seems legitimate, only to discover later that it contained a malicious attachment. This attachment, once opened, infects your computer with ransomware. Your files are encrypted, held hostage by unseen criminals demanding payment for their release. This is the reality of malware on the dark web. Cybercriminals use the dark web to buy, sell, and distribute malware with impunity. They create sophisticated viruses designed to exploit vulnerabilities in your operating system and software. 
and they're constantly developing new and more insidious ways to attack your devices and steal your information. The dark web is a minefield of malware, and even the most tech-savvy users are at risk. Section 7. Don't be a target practical tips. So how can you protect yourself from the dangers of the dark web? The most obvious answer is also the simplest, stay away. The dark web is not a place for casual browsing or satisfying curiosity. It's a dangerous world best left unexplored, but protecting yourself online goes beyond simply avoiding the dark web. Here are some practical tips to stay safe. Use strong, unique passwords. A strong password is your first line of defense against cyber criminals. Make sure it's long, complex, and different from the passwords you use for other accounts. Keep your software updated. Software updates often include security patches that fix vulnerabilities hackers could exploit. Be wary of suspicious links and emails. Don't click on links or open attachments from senders you don't recognize. Use a reputable antivirus program. A good antivirus program can help protect you from malware, viruses, and other online threats. Remember, the internet is a powerful tool. By taking the proper precautions and staying informed, you can navigate the digital world safely and responsibly. Section 8. The Ethical Quagmire The dark web isn't just a haven for criminals. It can also be a place for whistleblowers to expose corruption, for journalists to protect their sources, and for activists living under oppressive regimes to communicate freely. This raises complex ethical questions. On the one hand, the anonymity of the dark web can be a force for good, allowing individuals to exercise their right to free speech without fear of reprisal. It can be a lifeline in countries where freedom of expression is suppressed. On the other hand, this same anonymity enables criminal activity, making it difficult to hold those who exploit and harm others accountable for their actions. It's a moral tightrope walk with no easy answers. The dark web in many ways is a reflection of our own society, a complex mix of good and bad, right and wrong. It forces us to confront uncomfortable truths about ourselves and the world we live in. Section 9. The Long Arm of the Law While the anonymity of the dark web might seem like a shield of invincibility for criminals, law enforcement agencies around the world are actively working to penetrate its defenses. They're developing new techniques to track down criminals operating on the dark web and bring them to justice. The takedown of the Silk Road, a notorious online black market, is a prime example of this. The FBI, through painstaking investigation and international cooperation, was able to identify and apprehend Ross Ulbricht, the site's creator. This sent a clear message. The long arm of the law can reach even the darkest corners of the internet. Law enforcement agencies are becoming increasingly sophisticated in their methods. They're using advanced technologies to track cryptocurrency transactions, infiltrate online forums, and de-anonymize users. The cat and mouse game between law enforcement and cyber criminals continues, with no clear winner in sight. The message is clear. Just because you can't be seen, doesn't mean you can't be caught. The consequences of engaging in illegal activities on the dark web are real. Section 10. Curiosity killed the cat, don't let it be you online. The internet is a vast and fascinating place. It's a source of endless information, entertainment, and connection. But like the physical world, the online world has its dark alleys, places you're better off avoiding. The dark web is one such place. The allure of the unknown, the forbidden can be strong, but the risks associated with the dark web far outweigh any perceived rewards. By staying informed, practicing safe online habits, and resisting the temptation to venture into the digital underworld, you can protect yourself and your loved ones from the dangers that lurk in the shadows of the internet. Remember, curiosity might not kill the cat in the real world, but online it can lead to a world of trouble. Stay safe and stick to the well-lit paths of the internet. Section 11. Stay safe, stay informed. The internet is constantly evolving and so are the threats. New dangers emerge every day. The best way to protect yourself is to stay informed. Keep up to date on the latest online threats and how to avoid them. Follow cybersecurity experts and organizations online. Pay attention to news stories about data breaches and cyber attacks. And don't be afraid to ask for help if you need it. There are many resources available to help you stay safe online. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you know about the dangers of the dark web and how to protect yourself, the better equipped you'll be to navigate the digital world safely and responsibly. 
Stay informed, stay vigilant, and stay safe.